In this video tutorial, we will learn about how to interface a PIR or a motion sensor with that of Arduino inside the Proteus. So for it, first of all, we need to take this PIR sensor along with this PIR sensor, you also need one Arduino Juno. So you can take from here. Now you can use any of the Arduino. You can download it from a lot of links given in the Google or any other websites. You can download the library and can use it within your Proteus. I have also given the link of this Proteus file inside the description so you can also download this file from that link. So here we have one PIR sensor that is motion sensor and one Arduino. But in order to see the output we also need the virtual terminal. So virtual terminal is actually a serial monitor terminal. So in this virtual terminal there are two pins RXT and TXT and we will just use these two pins. So RXT must be connected with that of the TXT and TXT must be connected with that of the RXD of the Arduino. You also need to connect the pin number 3 of PIR sensor with that of the a not pin of the Arduino and pin number 2 of PIR sensor with that of the ground. Now you also take one logic toggle right here logic toggle And then press OK. OK, now our circuit is completed. Now, in order to process the data or input given to the Arduino, Arduino just need a simple program. So, we have already written that. It is a simple program in which just it is checked that either some input comes at a naught pin of the that is analog zero pin of the Arduino or not. So we need to copy this link. And press Ctrl C. Double click on this Arduino and paste it here. Okay, now run it. Okay, we, we got one problem. That is, first double click on this PIR sensor and click this at the hierarchy module. Then press play. And here you can see that motion not detected is written. But when we will give an input from the PIR sensor, motion not detected will be seen. So hopefully you got the concept. The Proteus file given inside the description will help you to implement this circuit. If you find any sort of difficulty, you can comment in the comment section and I will respond you on the same day. So, thanks for watching this video.